Um, in New York, well, my, name, my, my question is, what are some things in New York that need to be redesigned? Um, in New York, the probably hardest thing to overcome is thermal expansion, because even though you may think it's cold when it's 30 degrees here, the range of temperature in Baton Rouge is really only like 30 to 100 degrees. In New York, it's like negative 20 to about 90. And um, that's not such a big deal, except when you're talking about roads and bridges and ice, which can get in cracks, and ice expands, obviously, when it freezes. And uh, that creates a lot of issues. I know one thing in particular they're having a lot of trouble with right now is the Tappan Zee Bridge, which crosses the Hudson River into New York City. And it's almost three miles long, and hundreds of thousands of people use it to transit, <coughs> transit to New York every day. And the toll at, on the Tappan Zee Bridge is five dollars because it's very expensive to maintain. And one thing that they do with it is there's, I think there's like five or seven lanes, but they only open like three at any one time. They're always working on the other ones. So the Tappan Zee Bridge is a really old bridge. They opened in the 50s, and uh, it's in terrible shape because it was sort of poorly designed a long time ago with lesser materials, and now they kind of have to just patch it together because they can't shut it down, it's too long and too many people need it. So, uh, the Tappan Zee Bridge needs a lot of help, but I'm not so sure what they're going to do about it. Um, especially because it's a bridge, so it's above the ground, so the cold and the heat can get to it twice as much and cause all the more thermal expansion and all the stresses associated with that, including ice breaking it up. So, the thing that needs some redesigning is the Tappan Zee Bridge, but I don't know how they're going to do it.